Hey, welcome to the third video in this series, and um, I applaud you for sticking with this. I'm going to tell you something. This is definitely a business that's very doable for for just about anybody. It's uh, it's a it's it's fun and it's it's exciting. It's been doing this for a few years now, and we really we're, it's really exciting to us. And the more Logan and I talk about this, we, the more we know that we could help others by uh, helping them supplement their incomes or walk away from working for someone else to be able to have freedom to make more money if you put in more effort um, to work from home all those things we, we enjoy all those things we basically run our our junk removal business from our house here and uh, it's I don't know some of the things that probably went through your mind when I just said that but might have been uh, well I don't have enough space well, I bet you do. I mean, we're in a small uh, house. Uh, we're running out of a two-car garage, and we put stuff on the uh, on the back porch. Now, fortunately, this house is kind of secluded away from the neighbors, and uh, you can't really see any of that stuff. But I I'm, I'm just want to tell you that, that there is a process, and the process that we do when we pick stuff up is we basically we run an ad, we get a call, we go out and pick it up. At this point, 95% of our 99, probably 99, you think, Logan? About 99% of our, our pickups are all paid. So they're paying us to come and get stuff. And then what we do is we turn around and we get it back to the house, but, but we go to the dump first. That way, we throw off the stuff that we can't do anything with. We put the stuff that we're going to do for yard sales, and I give that stuff to my dad. We do the stuff for eBay and put them in one bin and then we take the scrap metal and stuff like that and we put it in another bin. So we kind of separate things as we as we load the truck. There's a process. There's a process to everything. If you do this business with the knowledge of the processes that we've come to learn over the last five years, it makes it pretty it makes it very user friendly. You know, so if you want to have the freedom to work your own hours, to work from home, to uh, to pretty much, you know, work for yourself and to make a decent living, this is a good option. So at any rate, the um, some of the things that we picked up, uh, this business is it's like storage wars and pickers, but on steroids. The the things that we get that they're just incredible. I'll give you a few examples. Uh, a couple days ago, we did a free pickup. It was an estate sale situation. I talked to this lady and I could just tell she had some really good stuff. Someone else had not shown up prior to that and she wanted to make sure that she was going to get somebody who would show up. So we're known for that. So one, the best item that we got out of that, and we got a lot of really nice items out of that, the best item we got out of that was a, a, a riding lawnmower. The riding lawnmower still had the little tabs on the, uh, on the wheels. They were partially worn off, but they weren't worn all the way off. We got that. Uh, we tried to start it up and start right up, start up right away. So we took it and we had it serviced. Um, spent 150 bucks on it to have it serviced and sold it in a day. Well, probably two days. It took about two days to sell it and sold it for 550 bucks. So uh, we got a jet ski that we picked up. Uh, had it serviced and we still have it. It's in the it's in the uh, back on a trailer and we use it. It's, uh, so we basically more or less have a free, a free jet ski. We got a boat. Uh, one of the other junk removal companies called us and uh, was looking for some advice on where to take a boat. And he told me what he had and I volunteered to go pick it up for free. And uh, it turns out we, uh, we sold it to someone. We got only $400 for it. The guy called me back. He was so excited. We, we very, very seriously were tempted uh, to keep that boat. It was a Mako boat, which is a high-quality boat. So excited, he called me. He says, it started right up, which didn't surprise me at all. There's so many of these things that you think are just, there's just no way they could work. And it's amazing how many times they do work. Okay, so here's what I want. Here's what I wanted to, to talk to you about it is basically... We're, we have a, a, a free subscription site, and basically what I'm looking for is a conversation. I, I'd like to know what you would like to know 
about getting yourself into a business like this and uh, either supplementing or creating a new business for yourself. I, uh, I just don't know what people would really want to know and I would love to provide the information. It is, I'm just telling you, this is an exciting, it's a fun business. I'm doing it with my son. We have, we have great fun with it. We rarely ever go out and buy a bunch of different things like toilet paper or furniture or um, we rarely buy paper towels or cleaning supplies. And we do draw the line at the food stuff for some reason, but um, it's amazing what this business provides and the, the amount of money that you save because you're not spending money. Now back to where I, 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 I always get off on tangents. I can't help myself. I just, that's just the nature of being me. But so, so basically we have a free subscription site. Uh, we'd love for you to opt into that. Um, you can do it through our website. It's www.howtomakemoneywithjunk.com. And, um, you know, what do you want to know? What else do you want to know? And Logan's uh, reminding me that the, the things that I talked about earlier, about the things that we got for a certain price and sold, he's going to put some images up and what we sold them for just so that you can, uh, you can see what we're talking about. And uh, we just wanted to thank you for stopping by and uh, looking forward to the conversation. So thank you.